This video is about how we design and build systems at Genco. I'll go over what we do in a separate video. The first step is clarity. What does this do? What's important about it? How does this fit into the overall manufacturing process? Those requirements are developed into sketches and we gather customer input, combine that to make a CAD design. Once the customer is signed off on that, we build the system. This is how we go about doing that. We start off with steel and aluminum. This material gets loaded into our Omax water jet, which cuts out the rough blanks of the individual components that are used to build the system. When these plates are out of the machine, we hand finish the surfaces and smooth out the edges. All the interior features, including the holes, are finished. Other pieces will go through our manual, milling, or machining centers, depending on the complexity of the features. Materials are heat treated to increase their hardness. Then they are ground flat, square, and parallel. We use electrical discharge machining to create intricate and precise details in the hardened steel. This type of EDM is called a sinker because it sinks an electrode into the material. We also use wire EDM technology to cut out very precise components from hard wear resistant materials and these form the backbone and the basis of many of the tools that we incorporate into our systems. What you're looking at here is a very small wire stretched between two guides with an electrical charge that's creating millions of sparks. Each one of those sparks is blasting off a tiny little particle of steel and leaving behind a shape. This allows us to make extremely accurate 2D shapes and even 3D shapes. These bushings were wire EDM from solid carbide in several different directions. After all the individual pieces are completed, they get grouped together by subassembly. The precision tooling at the core of the system is assembled and tested. And then all the custom components that we've produced are integrated together with purchased items to complete a system. Other systems consist of multiple modules. These are all assembled, integrated, and then all the systems are run off with actual production parts. After final cleanup and inspection, everything is crated up and shipped to the customer. Thank you for watching.